Hi everybody, my name is Richard. Just recently bought a backpack. It's a Highlander 33 litre. The one main compartment of 30 litres. The two side pockets, about a litre and a half each. The reason why I want to make this video, mainly to shout out to the company I bought it from, called contactleft.co.uk. Outdoor equipment, fantastic and they donate as well to charity every time you leave them a good review okay so this is the highlander 33 litre backpack i'm six foot two i'm a large lad as you can see and it fits quite comfortably on my shoulders uh, i don't use the waist pack uh, the waist strap sorry because i can't get it around the waist because i'm a big boy but i've had it fully laden with food for shopping really really comfortable why am I doing this video? Um, when I was researching all the different bags on the market, every time I came to this bag, um, the reviews were rubbish really, you couldn't really see the bag, so I'm going to try and show you as much of the bag as possible. And not so much of me. Okay, here we go. So, Ballistic Nylon, which is, uh, I think, one of the strongest nylons you can get so it's basically fully waterproof very robust do what you like to it it's not going to falter in any way um, the company Highlander um, I haven't heard from them before I was searching on the internet for a backpack and they popped up I saw the rest of their range and I was humming and hawing with a, a 30 litre or the 40 litre so it'd be a 44 or 33 litre so it's full, uh, 30 litre main compartment, just one cavernous hole, if you like. I know you can't see in there, but trust me, it's, it's huge. Two side pockets, one there, one there, litre and a half, ample space for everything you want to carry. Excellent, I should imagine, for bushcraft and uh, camping. Uh, I use it daily. I might consider purchasing the 44 litre only because I do carry quite a bit of stuff, especially when I go to work. But at the moment, it's brilliant. This arrived today and I couldn't wait to get it out of the packet and to thank the company that I got it from. Absolutely amazing. Okay, so what have we got? We've got the main compartment. There is a bladder compartment at the back. Uh, I know you're going to ask, can you fit a laptop in it? I have no idea, I have no intention of putting a laptop in it. But there is a bladder holder at the back of this bag. Top of the bag, got the bungee cords, like most bags. In the back, on the back, you do have another pocket. Some of them I've noticed online, they come with rain covers. This one doesn't need it because it is, well, what I used to know is ballistic nylon. So, even if it pours down, it's waterproof because nothing's going to happen to it. Obviously, you don't want to submerge or anything, but hey, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Carry handle, grab handle at the back, strong, very, very strong. Rubber, ballistic nylon, fantastic. Pads for the shoulders, they're quite thick actually, quite like that. Because there was no reviews as such online, I couldn't really determine if they were thick enough. But yeah, they are good, really good. Adding on the back, uh, no sweat. It, you know, you probably get a little bit hot, but not too much. Uh, what else can I say about this bag? The Molly, is it Molly's? Molly's, Molly's? To attach other equipment. So you've got them all down the front. Probably can't see it because it's black on black. Okay, all down the front of this. So you can tie what you want to it. On the sides as well, on the side pockets. And you've got them on the shoulder straps as well, as well as the old D-rings. So this is a Pro Force Highlander 33 litre backpack, day sack. If Highlander's out there watching this and they think, oh, he's good at doing videos, let's send in the 44 litre. I think I might need a 44 litre. Uh, what else have we got for you? You can tie, there you go, that was the other thing. Axe or walking poles. You do have a strap here 
and the strap to hold it at the bottom. So there's the strap at the bottom, there's the strap at the top. Okay, all that done. Anything else we can think of? I'm in awe over this bag. I am seriously a mess of the kitchen. I didn't know where else to do it. What do I do as well? Because this is just one huge gaping hole. I put colour dry sacks in. So I know what I'm picking out of the bag. So it's my stuff for work in one bag, food for work in another bag, different colours. You can pick these up quite cheaply. Over all in all, I like this bag. Really, really, really strong clips. Oh, I forgot to say, didn't I? Because you know, I know it's like 33 litres all in all, but if you consider the actual drawstring cover as well, we get another maybe litre, two litres. So there's the top of the bag. This is, I call it snow cover or something, but or okay, it's not rigid, but you can pile things up and you can still get the lid on. You do have two drawstrings, you've got one for the snow cover and then one to quench it all together and then the hood goes on the top and then the buckles go on. So I do hope you can see that because this is what I was missing on all the other reviews on YouTube, which I'm putting this on, hopefully. And this is too long and they kick me off. Okay. Very, very good. Very, very strong. Totally recommend it. And if you are in the need of anything bushcrafty or camping or outdoorsy stuff, okay, this company, www.contactleft.co.uk. Have a look at their website. Brilliant, guys. Really, really helpful. Uh, I bought it on Amazon, they were saying on Amazon. Again, if Highlander is watching this, if you want to send me a, a bigger one in black for me to try, be much appreciated. Thanks for watching. No need to subscribe because I'm, unless I find something else to do a review on, this will be it. Cheers, bye.